Welcome back to the Reggie Lewis Center, ready now for the women's 60-meter hurdles here at the New Balance Invitational. There you see the numbers. Three of the top seven ranked women in the world are in this race. There you see the lineups. The woman we will be watching will be starting right in lane five. Her name is Melissa Morrison, coming back off surgery last October. She has gotten her indoor season off to a great start. She left her sport behind a couple of years ago, only to realize after the fact how much she was missing. She has come back strongly. Just getting back on the scene, really, in 1995, took like a year off after my senior year. Um, I love track and field. And when I took that year off, I really did miss it. I watched it a lot on TV. And I saw a lot of the people that I used to compete against in school and I saw them doing really well. And I felt like, I mean, I could compete on that level. So I decided to give it a shot and start training again. She began working with Coach Curtis Fry in elite running company, including men's Olympic champion, Alan Johnson. It's like chasing after a gold medal every day at practice, so. And it, I mean, to have training partners there, it helps motivate you. you. You get up, you go to practice, whereas if you're by yourself, it's hard to get up hard to get up and say I have to go to practice especially when it's 30 degrees out so it's kind of hard to motivate yourself when you're training by yourself so to have those training partners there it's really good for me the woman loves her work and it shows she comes into this meet off a personal record 7.87 second upset win in the Milrose games in Madison Square Garden last week Larry I thought perhaps her best race ever uh, it just came from behind and took the woman ranked number two in the world Michelle Freeman and beat her there you see Dion Rose coming from Veer Tech High School in Jamaica. She went to Middle Tennessee State, but that also produced Merle Naughty and Dion Hemmings. Rose in lane number three, lane four, Cheryl Dickey, bronze medalist of the 97 World Indoor Championships. It's Morrison in lane five. Watch her. And in the first three strides, she pulls away from the field. Here comes Dion Rose in black to the inside, but this is all Melissa Morrison. Well, I started talking about this at our Milrose uh, meet last week, but she trains down at the University of Southern Cal University of uh, South Carolina with Coach Curtis Fry, and he says she's a three-year project. He said a lot of talent, good speed. He said I've got to harness the speed, and I've got to also get her more efficient over the hurdles. And he's really having great success here in his second year working with her. Good head-on shot right now. These are 33-inch hurdles, two feet nine inches high. She gets off to a great start. The key is the first two hurdles. The rhythm is there. She's not coming up too close in the hurdles. Excellent, excellent race. And Rose, keep in mind, is a 1996 Olympic finalist. And look how much Melissa Morrison, now training down at Columbia, beats Dion Rose. I mean, remember, the woman in second place, an Olympic finalist in 1996. Look at that margin and eases up at the finish. The youngsters lean right through that tape. Fine race, Melissa Morrison coming on strong for the United States here early in this 1998 season. Two races, two victories for athletes training under Coach Fry. Melissa Morrison, a new meet record, 7.93 seconds over Dion Rose and Cheryl Dickey. Down to Lewis. Okay, Melissa, 793, a new meet record. That's got to be a pretty sharp performance for somebody who was concerned about the start. Oh, yeah, um, I'm coming off of a little bit of adrenaline rush from Miro, so I wanted to follow up with a good meet here. Um, I'm happy with my win, but not with my time. Well, you know, it's been interesting. You went through the surgery in October, and that doesn't seem to hamper you at all. Um, yeah, I was, I was kind of worried about it after my surgery going into my first race, but after I got that over with, everything was fine. Your okay. training partner, Alan Johnson, he'd be proud of you tonight, don't you think? Oh, I'm, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he would. Congratulations. Thanks. Thank you. Okay. Thanks.